basically, I was pretty good shot. I was content as long as I had paper and, and pencils and pens. And like, I was a good shot. I was happy camping, you know, like, do not let us go in the car and I don't have stacks of paper. What, what age did you realize? Like, at what point were you like, okay, I got something for me? Basically, I would say right before I got to middle school, because like, I was always drawn. Like, I recognized my talent at a very young age. And my first idol, I could say, would have to be. Walt Disney is because um, <laughs> I, I, like I grew up, you know, the first Disney movie I, I ever saw, and I was so young, it was like, and I thought that that was my since I was not gonna know any better. I thought that that was the first Disney movie ever oh, yeah. <laughs> since I that was the first one I saw, and but it wasn't, and so I was like, wow, like I'm so you know in shock at how they do this like 2D animation. Like I want to be an animator for Walt Disney. I, I, I want to be in the city. I don't want to. Um, I want to make moves in this. I want to make a name for myself. Like, I don't. Of course, recognition is everything. I don't need so much of it as far as like consuming. You know, taking over, taking away from. I want to be known for my work. Like, it's like you guys a present. Are, like, yeah, it's like you guys are my pieces, basically. Because um, so, basically, I do illustration. The people that I find somewhat influential in some way, like, even if they don't have anything on, sometimes it's like it's something about them. Yeah, that, you know, so like, capture. Yeah. <laughs> I love that, and then when I saw that you do it, and then I was like, you got it down so right. Like, I was like, that's definitely her hair. Her face, her hair, her face, the way she was posed. Like, cause she physically looks like that. Now, one thing I noticed about your artwork, it's very, very clean. It's very, like, stark, on, but in a good way. So it's like, it stands out. I started with Marquis Pfeiffer, and that's, I guess you, that's the first one I got recognized by a lot of people, and other people wanted to, you know, basically have their, have their own. I know a lot of people do want one, and I don't <laughs> mind. <laughs> I can't say yes to every single person, because, like, I can't. I can't. I, mean, I guess right now it's influential to be like, really inspired by, by Constantine. I'm really inspired by, um, Takashi Murakami. He is a Japanese artist. His work is mind blowing. Like because, like you said, like my work is very animated, and it looks real at the same time. Which that's what I love about it. You know, because like if I'm gonna do illustration, I didn't want to do the normal, like you know, the normal too goofy or too um, or it's too serious. I'm influenced by style. Um, the style is a form of art as well. I can even be influenced by people who are, you know, chefs, you know. Why I sell it, Oscar De Lorenzo are two of the people that I know that not too many people design and do their own sketches as well. Like, oh. YSL can draw for days, yeah. he can sketch for days. Yeah. Like, yeah. those sketches are amazing. Like, that's crazy insane. Yeah, and, and Carl too. Yeah. Well, Valentino too. Well, Valentino, Valentino does have a way, he has a way of just drawing, like, the silhouette of the design yeah. instead of like the detail of the yeah. silhouette. And they just tell you to do it. <laughs> that just goes. The goal basically is to, I want a solo exhibition. And um, after that, I would love to do illustration for um, magazine publishing, um, the New York Times. That would be a win for me. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming. We had, yeah.